What's going on guys? Uh, today I wanted to bring you another video that's a little bit atypical of the type of videos that I've been releasing lately. But it's one that I wanted to release sort of to track the overall progress of the channel. Now, for those of you who have been subscribed for a long time to my channel, you know that I used to do these sort of status updates on the channel as a whole, you know, how many subscribers there are and um, walking through some of the metrics, things of that nature. And I like to sort of keep an eye on um, on this stuff from time to time because it's interesting to me to see how the channel grows, right? And so um, I wanted to share some information with you guys um, in terms of if you're thinking about actually starting a YouTube channel of your own, um, what some of the growth is that you can expect and where I think I've actually gone um, potentially wrong in some places where um, maybe you guys can learn something from that, right? So uh, I'm going to go ahead and jump into this real quick and we will crack on. Okay. So the very first thing that I want to point out is today is January 18th, 2021, right? So this video is as of then. And so uh, if I actually start off with the dashboard, uh, currently at the time of recording, we are sitting at 4,662 subscribers. And if we go into our analytics, and I'm actually gonna change this from last 28 days to, um, let's go with last, Let's go with lifetime actually. Um, and so um, what I kind of want to display here is basically how much money I've made off the YouTube channel, which is, as you can see, not a lot. Um, so since this channel has existed, which I launched it right back here um, sometime in 2016, uh, I've made $102 from this channel, right? In that entire time. So. Um, but there are some caveats to that that I want to sort of mention. Um, so it's almost at 4.7k subscribers, um, and I've got about 11,500 hours of watch time and about 153,000 uh, views, right? So none of these numbers are particularly impressive, but um, there are some things that I sort of wanted to touch on along the way, right? So uh, first and foremost, the the video with the most views on my channel, ironically, is one of the first ones I ever actually put out. And it's actually completely unrelated to the rest of the content on this channel, which was a review I did for my um, 2016 Subaru. Um, and interestingly enough, that still gets hits and traffic. So uh, I used to have a lot more car related content on this channel, but this is actually the only one that I've left active on the channel because it still seems to be pretty popular. Uh, most of the other car videos, I actually moved off to a different channel. Uh, but we can see here that that's got 39,000, almost 40,000 views. Um, and then the, the next uh, most popular one after that is the, uh, is the TypeScript WebGL um, engine tutorial, the very first video, and that's got 16,500 views. Then we've got uh, the Vulcan Game Engine live stream, which is uh, now a discontinued series. So that actually shows up here um, a couple of times. Um, and then uh, we've got more WebGL stuff. And then a couple of my really old videos, um, which it's interesting to me that these are actually still getting uh, traffic, but they are. Um, but what I really wanted to point out was, you know, this is not a a typical growth pattern that you see in a lot of channels. And I've looked at a lot of YouTube channels um, showing channel growth, and this is very, very atypical, right? So I basically had this massive spike right here in the very beginning, right? And that was this video here. Um, that is when this got, got its a majority of its views. Um, and then sort of in this time between here and here, um, I didn't really do a whole lot. You know, I sort of just the channel sort of stagnated, right? I didn't do a whole heck of a lot. Um, and then sometime in, like, I think it was 2018, uh, I started, actually, I think it was, might've been 2017. Sometime around 2017, I actually rebooted the channel as a game development channel. And I think at around that time I had about I want to say it was about 70 subscribers, um, 70 or 75 subscribers. And so the channel is basically dead at that point, right? 
um, but I decided to sort of reboot it. And so um, that in and of itself was already, you know, sort of atypical. Right around here, this first spike is the 10 mistakes I made in game development, right? Um, and then there's been a couple videos that have spiked along the way. But one thing you'll notice is that the, um, the channel really started to take off after that, right? After I did a few live streams, um, that is when the channel sort of picked up. But then you'll notice there's sort of this other, this sort of additional lull right here, right? So the channel sort of started to sharply pick up and then it dropped off. And that is because at the time I had actually stopped uh, making videos. So pretty much for most of 2019 and part of 2018, I didn't actually make any videos or release any videos at all. I think I did one, maybe two videos and that was about it. And it wasn't until um, late last year in 2020 that I actually started making content again. And so everything just sort of stagnated at that point um, up until we got to late last year. So I'm actually gonna snip this down to the one year, right? Just to sort of get a, a better view of this, right? So in the last 365 days, um, we can see here that our views were pretty much flat until right up around here in November where I started uploading again, right? And now it's actually started growing again. So one of the major mistakes that I made is I had a decent amount of traction and I sort of let it go, right? I didn't up upload for a long time. I think if I'd kept uploading, the channel would probably be a lot larger now than it actually is. Um, so that's really unfortunate, but unfortunately also life got in the way. Um, you know, I had a lot of personal things happen, a lot of things professionally that happened that sort of got in the way and it's just what it was, right? Um, but now that I'm in a different situation, that type of volatility isn't really in my life anymore, right? So I'm able to create content and schedule things out and um, and actually be more consistent with it, right? And and I can see here that that's, that is actually starting to pay off. Okay, so another thing that I should mention is this monetization, right? Because you'll notice that most of this... Um, most of the that $102 that my channel has made is actually not recent, right? Most of it is actually back here, right? So if I actually click over to this, you will see that, right? So uh, most of that has just been sitting stagnant because of, uh, you know, this, this video just sort of was super popular and then it died off. And then we notice it actually flatlines here. And this, this was the uh, change that they made on YouTube where you had to have a thousand subscribers and four thousand hours of uh, watch time in order to actually qualify for monetization so my channel actually lost its monetization right around this point right and so i made nothing on the channel throughout this entire time um which was relatively okay i mean i wasn't i hadn't really started this to make money to begin with really the only reason i monetize this channel is at all is to sort of offset some of the other costs that i have in running it right um and so for this entire time, I made absolutely no money whatsoever. Now, um, sometime around mid-November, I actually hit a point um, just naturally where I actually, um, I had been at the thousand subscriber uh, minimum for a long time, but I didn't have the watch time I needed. And sometime around November that actually happened, right? And so um, I was able to, to reactivate monetization on the channel and I started uploading again regularly. And you can see here that now there's a pretty decent little uh, little bump there, right? And so, um, you know, obviously I hope that, you know, I, I hope to see these kind of numbers again at some point. But um, again, that's not really the, the primary purpose of this channel. But I know that a lot of you guys that have been asking me these questions are interested in that. So that is it, right? I'm not making tons of money off of this. Uh, I'm not getting that fat YouTube money, right? Um, this is it, 102 bucks. I guess my, my biggest piece of advice here would be that if you are trying to grow a YouTube channel, make sure that you're consistent. Don't do what I did and sort of let it sit for a long time and not upload to it, right? Because it sort of kills any um, any traction that you had along the way. And so I'm working very hard now to get that traction back um, so that I can grow the channel. And um, you know, it it's, it's not quite like starting from scratch, but it almost, um, 
you know, it's, it's been very hard to get traction. I guess that's really all there is to mention, at least for now. So I hope you guys found this interesting. Um, if you guys would like me to do more of these type of videos, let me know. Um, let me know in the comments if you guys like this or um, if you guys don't like this, don't find it interesting. Let me know that as well, um, because any of that kind of feedback is helpful. I will uh, I will take that into account. So uh, I appreciate all of you guys uh, that have subscribed to the channel. And any newcomers, of course, I appreciate you guys as well. Thank you very much. If you guys found this useful, go ahead and hit that like button. It actually helps me a lot, right? It's going to help me uh, regain some traction on, on this, right? Um, because I'm really looking to grow this channel and reach um, a lot more people and be able to Im make a bigger impact on the game development industry as a whole by hopefully motivating more people to um, want to write low level game code. And so I can only do that if I have a wider reach. So feel free to, um, you know, like, subscribe, uh, hit that little bell icon so that you guys get notifications when new channels um, videos drop. And, um, you know, don't, it, if you guys really like my channel, I encourage you to share it with other people and um, help me grow it, right? Because it's, I, I hope that it only is gonna come out to benefit um, anybody who watches it, right? Because I, I really have a passion for spreading knowledge and, um, and attempting to help educate people, um, on game development. So I think that's all there is to say. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and wrap this video up here. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will catch you guys on the flip side.